A lot of opportunity to work on a lot of things. Just what's your sense of uh, this team and the mood going into this game against Arizona? Uh, I think uh, you know, you're going to see a sense of urgency from the guys. Uh, it's been a couple of hard days in practice, um, both on and off the ice, just uh, with some video and stuff like that. And uh, you know, just trying to work on areas that we can improve. Obviously, we haven't been at our best the last uh, four or five games, but um, you know, I think uh, you know, we're, hopefully we're going to turn the page here. 26 games left. There's been a lot of talk over maybe the last few weeks, even of playing playoff type games. Did we kind of see a playoff type game and team in Chicago the other day? And can you learn some lessons from the way they kind of dug in and, and scored scrappy goals and all that? Yeah, I mean, uh, they've won three cups in the last six years for a reason. And, um, you know, they're, uh, they're obviously a great team. And, uh, you know, they're, they know how to win. And, and, we're, and we're learning how to win. And, um, you know, I think we can take a lot of stuff from their game and try to implement it into ours. And uh, I'm not saying that we have to play like them, but there's a few things that we can definitely take away from them and add to our game. And, uh, you know, like I said, or like you said, sorry, uh, you know, those, those goals in the paint and getting pucks to the dirty areas and, you know, not trying to make the, the pretty play, just make the right play and, uh, you know, get a little grittier and, and play more playoff type hockey. Has that uh, sense of the playoffs looming and the seasons coming to a close, is that starting to find itself into the, the room? and? I don't know if it's pressure that you start to feel, but do you start to get that sense that, hey, it's almost spring, it's almost that time of year, we're in the mix, are you guys starting to kind of get that sense and taste? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, guys are starting to talk about it a lot more. The coaching staff is starting to talk about it, and, uh, you know, as you can see, the standings are, are, are real close, and, um, you know, with uh, 26 games left, it's, it's going to be even tighter, and, uh, you know, we just got to make sure we play playoff hockey the rest of the way through, and, and, and that's the way it's going to be. Every, every team is going to be playing that way, and it doesn't matter if they're first or last, it's going to be that type of hockey, and I know we just got to make sure we bring that every game. Having said that, what do you expect from this Arizona team that you know kind of had their way with the with the Flames last night? Yeah, they've they've been hot lately. They've won a lot of games, and uh, you know they're beating some pretty good teams. And uh, you know there's no there's no easy games in this league. It doesn't matter where you are in the standings. Um, just got to make sure you bring your game every time. And uh, you know any any team can beat any team on any given night. You just got to make sure you prepare yourselves as best you can. And, and uh, you know, make sure you give yourself the best chance to win. Finally, just uh, is there a sense of pressure for secondary scoring? Do you sense? And as a guy that's maybe expected to bring a little bit of that, I know you're a rookie still, but uh, is that talked about too? And is that kind of on the minds of guys? Yeah, I think uh, you know we can't rely on one line or one guy to you know kind of carry the load. It's got to be a you know top to bottom thing, and, and maybe not necessarily always scoring goals, but you know from top to bottom, the lineup's got to be producing at, at some sort of level, whatever it may be, whether it's. You know, doing well in the uh, you know special teams or or just chipping in whenever they can five on five and it doesn't have to necessarily be points but you know a big shot block or a big hit or momentum right so uh, you know everyone's got to chip in but uh, you know that secondary scoring is definitely something we need and uh, heading in a playoff uh, especially the playoff run you're going to need that secondary scoring to be a good team.